Early this month, Mars One launched a new element to its community platform, the Mars Exchange. This is an interactive system where Mars One advisors, NASA scientists and Mars One team members will post regular articles addressing key questions about the Mars One mission. The first two articles are now online, which focus on the ethics of one-way missions and potential biocontamination of Mars. But this is just the start, as Mars Exchange will soon be updated with new features, such as blog posts, webinars, interviews, Google Hangouts, and many more will be coming very shortly. I'll post a link to Mars Exchange below. Last month, I talked about the University Design Competition for a payload slot on the 2018 lander. There's been a great mixture of entries so far. Some particular highlights include a balloon system containing atmospheric experiments, a mobile exploration platform, a microphone and speaker to record and play sounds on Mars, a radiation measurement device, and a seismometer to detect ice deposits below the surface. I'll keep you updated as the competition proceeds until eventually we find out the winner. The 2018 mission is absolutely vital to the success of Mars One, as it will be the first demonstration that they can put actual hardware on the Martian surface. A successful mission will then make the raising of the estimated $6 billion required for the human mission that much easier. But the question remains as to how to find the hundreds of millions of dollars required just for the 2018 mission. Well, I'm pleased to say that things are actually moving quite well towards achieving that end, as Baz Lansdorp, the CEO of Mars One, confirmed at the 17th Annual International Mars Society Conference that a UK-based investment fund is interested in funding the entire 2018 mission. I'll keep you updated as more is revealed on this. And now, I'm excited to make a special announcement of an event coming to this channel early next month. Be sure to send your questions for the candidates and share the link to the event countdown when it goes live on September 1st. Finally, I'd like to thank all my subscribers. We've just reached 100 and this channel now has over 9,000 views. Ah, I hope you enjoy all the exciting content coming next month and I'll see you next week.